What's up guys, this is Bolt by the Fell Handed. I had a lot of requests to run the Type 59 solo. We are on Himmelsdorf, winner, standard battle. The greens have taken the northern spawn, the reds have taken the southern spawn. Now, there are two schools of thought. Uh, te technically three. You can push the tracks, okay, that's a viable option in a medium tank. You can push Banana Road. This tank has excellent armor. It can do that as well. Turret armor. It has excellent hull armor as well. Or you can take the top, which is also a viable option. Typically in your scrims, the teams will take the top because that is a very strong position. You can put a few shooters in the middle. You can put some on either side and you can essentially lock that complete area down a lot easier than locking down, say, the train yard down there at B2. <clears throat> Moving on. Obviously, you see I decided to take the top. And, you know, it just differs from time to time. If there weren't a lot of people coming up here, I probably would have busted a U and turned around and came back. But at the same time, you kind of have to do risk versus reward. If there's not a lot of people coming up here, then that's a better chance for you to do a lot of damage. But at the same time, it is also a better chance for you to get rolled. So, you have to more or less run the numbers in your head on exactly what you want to do. Now, you can also look at the enemy team list and see what kind of fast tanks they have. Exactly what are you going to be meeting up here. Assuming, of course, you're going to be the first one up here or if you just like to have that information. You know, primarily the heavy, the, the other team is compromised of heavy tanks. So you don't necessarily have to worry too much about them getting up here before you do. Aside from the couple of light tanks, there are some fast heavy tanks out there. I'm not aware of them in this tier. The AMX 50B is extremely fast, but it is not in this tier. So they're, they're just trying to come up the hill here. I am attempting to get in a good hold down position they're taking shots at my turret here and you know guys I am running strictly AP at this time and the reason for this is I'm just kinda seeing if I can pull the same shots that I did previously with APCR with AP I'm more or less certain I can as long as I you know you have your aiming down but you know guys this is what makes this tank such a strong hold down tank is you know the aiming time is more or less negated by the fact you're not really going to be doing a lot of moving in a fixed position and I, you know I've been talking about fixed positions a lot lately in my videos because normally you move to one area of the map and you work that one area until the reds are gone and that is pretty much how we do business so you know the the need for a tank that makes amazing clutch shots isn't necessarily there anymore because unless you're just running and gunning the entire map you're not really going to need it moving on I'm going to pull out here put a a clutch shot there in the side of this gentleman I didn't even aim the first one and then I realized as soon as I did that I said ah bull you gotta start aiming bud <laughs> so we went ahead and scoped in the next one and this right here is just me being curious. I was curious to see if I could pin the side of his turret. I was just curious to see if it was like the IS-7s. I had my side to him, so I kind of rushed that shot. Probably should have aimed it in better. Might have finished him off. Making a very good scope shot right now. Put it in him, and uh, I guess I didn't quite have the gun to finish him off. Going to go ahead and get my hull oriented towards him right now. Put him in his tracks. I'm like, will this guy please die he's looking at my turret he doesn't quite know what to get and then he gets killed and in this this uh, 34 black comes up derps it right into the ground I guess because he's afraid I would sneak one in him and then the other guy gets him gets rid of him but you know even though we've been doing very well up here on top of the hill if you look at the uh, top of the board there we are hurting as a team we are really in trouble so right now as you can see I've automatically turned around I'm heading back towards the cat because that is where I need to go the person who is flashing 
the Reds cap. <laughs> Just doesn't know how this game works. But moving on. Um, so right now, you know, guys, I'm going to go down here. My plan is is to hit the A line right there at A0 and just shoot down that line. I could even go B0, more or less, guys. It's your choice. Uh, you know, I, I kind of forgot, actually, what I did in this instance, and I did exactly what I thought I would do because it's me. So, you know, the plan here is... I took a clutch shot there, guys, and if you know this tank, you know how ridiculous clutch shots are there. Dodged around, which is incredible for this tank. Well, not for this tank, but in that particular situation. And then we lose. I, I, that dodge shot was particularly amazing in my case. I liked it. So, we did okay, guys. Uh, 2790, we did okay. We didn't do fantastic. But you know what? Not every game can be Shakespeare. Remember to subscribe, guys, and thank you for watching.